I'm Johnny Scoble, and this is Chase the Heat. Thanks for joining me. Guys, I got a cool one. I uh, recently did some uh, pickles from Sam's Choice. I did their maple bourbon. At that time, a lot of you guys said, you got to try the mango habanero. Look at that. That's a habanero. Mango habanero. I'm excited. I'm hopeful that these are going to taste great. Um, I'm hopeful. I liked the last pickles a lot. I gave them a good re good review. I just didn't like the fact that what I thought the greatest selling point of the pickle, being that there's maple and bourbon in there, nowhere to be found on the list. Uh, if that if those ingredients were in the natural flavors, I would like to see them spelled out. Uh, perhaps there's some sort of regulation uh, that prevented them, like there wasn't enough of it to appear in the label. I don't know. Maybe there's a reason. I, I would think there'd have to be because why would they not want that on the label? Would help. Anyhow. That's how I think. But if you guys have watched the channel for a while, you know how I am. Excuse me, I'm a stickler about stuff like that. So, here's what we got. I am hopeful, man. It's nice to see a habanero, a whole habanero in there. It's pretty cool. There's only one. And they stick it at the bottom, so you gotta wait for it. To me, I'm like a kid. You get, when you're a kid, like a thing of cereal, there's like a toy inside. You wanna get to the toy? That's me, that's my toy. I wanna get there. Anyway. Before we go any further, a big shout out to uh, Pickle, Pickle Team headquarters in Bundaberg. Uh, Commander Marugamia, uh, Little Chili Nipper, and Chili Mama Bird. Um, Pickle Team headquarters. Anyway, uh, here we go. Let me read you the ingredients of these pickles. Um, fresh cucumbers and a fine start, right? Um, water, sugar, uh, vinegar contains less than 2% of. You ready? Less than 2% of. Salt, dehydrated mango, calcium chloride, dehydrated habanero chili peppers, citric acid as a preservative. All right, natural flavors, polysorbate 80, turmeric extract for color. There you have it, people. All right, I am really hopeful. I, like I said last time, they nailed the flavor. The, the, the chips, the pickle chips, nailed it. Not tainting. Won't be tainting my pickle. Man, I want that habanero. Man, that's how tough these spoons are. Just dropped my spoon for the first time on there. A lot of you ask, hey, how's that spoon? It's tough. There's a moment in there. Just for a second, I was like, oh man, I'm gonna break this on film. I was gonna show it too. If it broke, that's how it works. But man, it didn't. Okay. Happy. Happy already, because you get the smell of the pickles, you get that you know, it's a pickled aroma. But I swear to you, I'm picking up the mango and I'm picking up the uh, habanero. The mango is pronounced. I really smell the mango. That's fantastic. Ah, I love that. I won't. I'm drinking this juice. Who's guilty of doing that? Who drinks? Who throws out pickle juice? Does anybody throw out pickle juice? Man, I don't. Especially spicy pickle juice? Are you joking? Who's going to throw that out? I'm eating that stuff. All right, guys. So we're going to... Uh, Sam's Choice. This is their habanero mango. Spicy pickle chips. Ah, really excited to munch on this. I'm Johnny Scoble, and this is Chase Heat. You know what's amazing? Less than 2% of uh, habanero and mango. Just imagine what they could do if they actually put some, some quantity in there, people. Don't let that fool you. I'm not unhappy. Okay, I'm happy.
Here's the deal, people. Sam's Choice. They make some good pickles. It's not hot. It says so, but it's not. I mean, they wouldn't print it if it wasn't true, right? Um, it's got zip. It's got a little bit of tang to it, a little bit of... It's zesty. Tangy. Lively. Oh, if you like pickle juice, this is fantastic. You get the mango. This is great. Now, heat. Um, they're not hot. It would not burn a child. I mean, got a little little sister Scoble. You've seen older sister Scoble. Her kids are grown. Little sister Scoble. She's my younger sister. She was here about. 20 minutes ago, had her two kids in tow. One of them, the youngest, I won't say his name, keep it private. Man, when he comes back, I'm gonna give him one of those chips, see what he says. He will not panic, they're not that hot. They're kind of a little zip, zippy. They're, ta they're tasty though. But you really can taste the habanero flavor. I can taste the habanero flavor, just not getting habanero heat. Uh, and I can absolutely taste the mango. And that's the cool part. The mango is more pronounced than the flavor of the habanero. So. The habanero's main influence is a little bit of zip, although you can taste it, but the mango is all over there, as far as flavor. Mm. Man, this is yummy. So, man, a little bit of chunks of garlic on the bottom of that. I'm so... Oh, I can't wait to get to the bottom of this thing. Anyway. The pickles are good. They're just not hot. Um, still happy with them. Can't complain. Um, Sam's Choice makes great pickles. Um, I, they should hire me on as their consultant. With just a little bit of tweaking, we could make them great. But that's not their goal. They're, they're, listen, they're not... Uh, their goal isn't, their target market isn't the Scoville squad, you guys. It certainly isn't me. I mean, I like their stuff, but their target market are just mainstream people who never, ever, don't eat anything hot. Who will eat that and go, whoa, these are hot. Still super yummy. I got people texting me like crazy. Who is it? Tommy Broom. Actually, I missed a call from Tommy Broom. That's all. That's Tommy Scoville. Anyhow, we're going to wrap this thing up. Great pickles. Great on, a, on like, burgers. On a, on, you know, they're just lovely. You're going to like them. Just don't, don't, you know, you don't need to worry about being burned by them. Because that ain't going to happen. But super tasty. Would I buy them again? Oh, yeah. I really would. They're, they're great. But here's what I would do. A habanero is so readily available. Go to a grocery store. Get a few of them. Cut them up. When the level gets down about here, throw a few, or you get rid of some of the pickles, throw some habaneros in there, seal that baby up. I've got uh, three or four jars of pickles in my apartment back in uh, South Carolina that I've docked it up with some super hots that are sitting there percolating, getting angry. One of them was supposed to, they were angry something. They were angry something, but they weren't angry. So I, I'm trying to get them angry. So anyway, um, Man, guys, get into some pickles. If, what, tell me what pickles you guys are eating. If you guys have had these, let me know what you think of, of them. Excuse me. In the comments section. Appreciate it. I might get uh, Papa Scoville in another video this afternoon. We will see. Uh, but surely, I'll be back for more. Guys, right there is our pickle. If you click that, our pickle. <laughs> That's what I said. Uh, there's our pepper. <laughs> Man, you know, when I first started, I would have made that a blooper. I would have said, oh, I can't post that. Here's our pickle and our pepper. Click it when you do your part of our family. If you don't want to miss a video, click the bell for notification. You miss nothing right there. It's League of Fire. Love and League of Fire right there. More videos. Hey, I love you guys. Thanks for hanging out with me. This is fun. I hope you have a great day. I'm Johnny Scoville. This was Chase the Heat.